of a ketchup and a and a show and tell and all that sort of stuff. Um, firstly, I'll just I've got to listen to the oven because I'm cooking my embellishments. Yes, cooking. Um, I'm. Uh, Fimo embellishments. I'm just cooking them as we speak and I'm just making some more out of my moulds that I've got. Right. Um, I'm in a couple of swaps and the first one I'm in, or one of them I'm in, let me just get to my my pile. Sorry, I've got an aniseed ball in my mouth. Right, um, now then, I've shown you the chunky charm. Okay, so I'm in a pretty in pink stick pin swap, and that's over at Crafty Swappers. And that's with, um, I think it's Jade Lewis that's hosting that one. And here are my, my stick pins. I have to stand up because I'm using a different camera. So. This is the um, one of the things I got the other day for 30 pence. So I've just decorated it up. You can still unscrew the top if you wanted to. And then here we've got these stick pins. I'll just show you. Are we focusing? Are we hackers like? Come on. Oh, I hate cameras. Right, anyway, so we've got, there's this one. And we've got four of those. Then we've got this one with the crystal and the glass pearl. And then there's one in the middle. It's like a glass bead with a heart on and got like a diamante in the middle so they all fit in there and that's what I've done for that so that's the first thing the second thing oh excuse me I'm in a butterfly swap over on craft swappers and uh, we have to do three sets of five paper butterflies now I didn't read the paper bit and I'll show you what I made after I've showed you this and I was like oh yeah great and then I read that it was paper so I uh, redid them all but anyway so my first one is just made out of some oops, some music paper some bead trim for the antennae one of these flowers I think it was Kaz that gave that to me and some feathers as another layer and some black dew drops for the tail so I've done that one this one's a a punch that's a heart punch from Martha Stewart so I've punched those out now these I think I got from Kerry Denier in a swap ages and ages and ages ago these um, chipboard butterflies um, and then I've made the antennae with some wire and then again some more bead trim and some feathers and then this one is I've stamped an image it's the indigo blue and I actually had the smaller version that I got free with another magazine so I've used the smaller version and then the bigger version and the bigger version I got from oops, the uh, this one here it's that one up there so right so that and then I've put some spick, spickles spe glitter glue around the outside and then some bling around there so I've done those but I'll show you what I did do in before that um, I was watching some of 
Jennings 644's videos actually and she does a um, butterfly that she uses wire and it's a bit similar to this one and some lace so she basically makes the the wire butterfly glues it onto here and then cuts it out so that one was inspired by Jennings 644 but these will go out in swaps and things like that anyway and then this one is a crocheted flower that I've turned into a the crocheted flower is inside here and then you pull down one of the petals and then it turns into a little butterfly one of my um, ribbon flowers and then I've just gathered some ribbon and this ribbon I got from China I think it was like 50 pence for 10 yards or something and then some the beaded trim so I'd just done those two and then I read oops, sorry everyone I read that it was paper but hey ho and then I'm also in a um, cork altered cork swap so I've been doing those today I've done this one and it's got like a dangle at the bottom they have to have a dangle and it's got a little angel on and the Eiffel Tower and then a cameo and some lace so that's that one and then this one's just a little bit different so I went this way and then there's like an earring there and then I've glued like the the bling on there bring it down and then you've got there we are I've got some more bling on either side and then I've just glued some flowers and whatnot so and then on the back there's just a little bit of braid and then some of these bead sprays and then some gold leaves that's that so that's all I've been doing really so um, well, I am actually supposed to be cooking my husband's scones but in the meantime I'm heating up the oven and cooking my um, embellishments go figure have a great day keep crafting